Hello, I am William Hudgens, principal clarinetist of the Boston Symphony and a member of the Boston Symphony Chamber Players for 25 years now. Welcome to our Boston Symphony Chamber Players virtual concert that took place at the Lindy Center this past summer. I hope you are well and managing to survive this discouraging pandemic. Due to the pandemic, you are going to hear three unusual pieces on this concert. Unusual in the sense that as a chamber music group, we rarely present unaccompanied solo pieces. So one of the fun things about this will be the chance to see a little of the personalities of Ed Barker, Steve Ansel, and Elizabeth Rowe in their respective solos. We take pride in our group for trying to be very faithful to what we think the composers have indicated for us to convey to the audience. But we all still bring a certain amount of ourselves to any piece. Maybe by which pieces they chose and what they emphasize in those pieces, you will understand some of what they are influenced by at this time. Another interesting aspect to this concert involves our guest pianist, Vivian Choi. It was the first time we had played with her and it turned out to be so rewarding and pleasant. She had quite the task set out before her, performing back to back the Poulenc Trio and the Brahms Trio, two very disparate composers. Poulenc, whose music is often quite technically virtuosic, but also needs to be light and humorous. Then you have Brahms, and especially this Brahms Trio, one of the last pieces of his composing career a piece that attempts to depict a lifetime of deep emotions with many complex harmonies and turbulent rhythms. I thought Vivian handled everything with such aplomb and brilliance, fitting in so well with Richard Sabota and John Frillo on the Poulenc, and then with Blaise Desjardins and me on the Brahms. For myself, I always find Brahms' music to be so moving and rewarding. And with this trio, I love how the cello and the clarinet sounds blend together to create one unique, full, rich tone. I've always enjoyed playing the solo lines by myself, but maybe because of how separated we have all been during this pandemic, I found myself longing for the parts where Blaise and I, and then Vivian too, could join together in lush, flowing, unison lines. I hope our performance will be both fun and meaningful for you. Please enjoy it and we hope to see you again soon, live and in person. <laughs>